well 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 i finished another sketchbook and that means it's time to take a tour um, with the previous sketchbook um, so this one is from may 2020 to november 2020 and <laughs> as you already know i like to decorate uh, these sketchbook covers with stickers and this time the theme was just anything comforting <laughs> since we all know uh, how 2020 was for everyone and put a little plant here to decorate um, this video I guess um, so anyway let's get started okay so here are some notes for for a vlog I did previously and this is a sketch for them um, the witch door um, bright month illustration I did in 2020 so here are all the the witch door characters who are uh, part of the LGBTQ plus community that's the sketch <laughs> here is Josia uh, knitting I had a dream <laughs> in in which he uh, I don't remember most of it anymore, but yeah, in the dream he was knitting for some reason, so I wanted to draw that. And here is uh, Josia and Cassius on a picnic, <laughs> eating ice cream, and then um, just Josia taking a nap. Uh, this was a chapter break illustration for transfusions, and here are Joa and Dulan as like D and D characters, uh, Yaw is a rogue and Dylan is some kind of mage. I really like this. This is pretty cute. <laughs> and these are character designs for a short comic um, idea I had. Yeah, it's a pretty fun idea, <laughs> story idea. But um, I need to still need to figure out a, an ending for it before I can actually make make the comic and yeah but the characters are like this this uh half japanese goth dude and this nerdy dude um and they um uh, this this guy is um game study student <laughs> i don't i don't hmm, maybe this was like a librarian or something and he, he also has a podcast and they meet in a game cafe um, this guy's board game group uh, misses a person and they ask this this guy to join them and yeah here's more more doodles of them And here are doodles of my Shadowrun character Tristan, who I miss, miss dearly still. Um, these were colored with, with my mom's watercolors and they, I don't know, they look kind of meh. But yeah, I just did colored them to kill some time. Here is Tristan again, the water watercolors. And more of these guys, I was trying to pick a name for them. Uh, I think I decided to name this guy Tommy, but I still I'm still not sure what what name to choose for this this guy. <laughs> Here are some Nilsa doodles. And Cassius I might have made a video of um, this page. If I did, I will link it there. Uh, <laughs> Duvlon in a dress and also handcuffed. 2020 was the 10 year anniversary of transfusions and I wanted to uh, celebrate it with um, fancy foil print and a giveaway. So this was the planning for that. 
really like this pose, but um, I wanted to change the faces a little bit, so here's the foil print. I did ju just um, like a small amount of them and um, for the giveaway and then I sold <laughs> the rest um, later. So yeah, these are not available anymore, <laughs> sorry. Let's move on. Um, this was my character for our um, Monster Hearts one-shot. It's I don't know how to explain it. It's like high school drama with monster uh, characters. So my character was a ghoul and she was called Lilia Hautalehto. <laughs> yeah, it was pretty fun. Um, yeah, fun and different. More um, Tristan. This was done with a brush pen. He's, he needs a shower. These were like meh Tristan doodles. Then uh, some like, green ballpoint pen doodles of Yoa and well, Dulan as well. Mm. And some Yosia. This was also with green, green pulpit pen and some watercolor added later. And this is with brush pen. They stand going somewhere. Mm. Didn't really get the pose that I wanted, so <laughs> never finished it. More Tristan. More Tristan without clothes this time, um, for reasons. Then we have some Katarina doodles, because I don't draw Katarina enough. I <laughs> should draw more of her. There was some, um, I don't know, like a meme or something on Twitter and <laughs> I drew this. Um, it was like OTP dynamic meme thing, I think. So I drew, drew or Yoa and Dylan kind of like opposites, <laughs> in opposite roles. And Dylan is just messing around. So cute. And more Yoa and Dulan cuteness. I really like this one. This is really cute. Ooh. And uh, another Yosia. Um, I really like this brush pen. It's one one of these, I think. But they're both like black. Uh, but these are my favorite brush pens. Uh, these are from Pentel. Or like one of my favorite brush pens. <laughs> Um, I really like how how like even and matte the ink looks. It's so nice. Uh, so yeah, that's your yeah. I don't know, your hands. More uh, brush pen doodles of Mark, and I colored this with watercolors. And more watercolor stuff. Uh, Yosia, I really like the colors here, but <laughs> he looks so so angry <laughs> for some reason. Uh, yeah, I really like the colors here. I don't know. Uh, more Yosia. I fucked up here. It's kind of the ink bled. So. Some doodles of Mark and Yoa. The time when Yoa was still a human and not yet a vampire, and Mark was still around before disappearing. Um, I really like these doodles, so I uh, cleaned them on Photoshop later. I'll add an uh, image of that here somewhere. Uh, yeah, I really like these ones. Uh, then Mark uh, with <laughs> with his cat Susie. Um, and Susie meeting your. Then I doodled this scene from um, Shaun of the Dead <laughs> with uh, with um, Joa and Mark and Jess, who is Joa's girlfriend. But uh, Mark and Joa are such um, 
best friend that it really really fits <laughs> fits this scene. Then here are some doodles of Yoa and well Dylan is there too. I bought some colored lead, so this is this was me testing them. I really like the violet lead. The only like downside of these LEDs is that you can't really erase them. Um, my favorite colored LED is uh, this one actually, um, and you can erase it, so that's really nice. So yeah, I like the violet, too bad you can't really erase it, so I have to be careful with it. Um, then here were some plans for uh, Guy and Mikael. Guy. Mikael, my roommate characters. <laughs> um, I wanted to make a cool gouache painting with them, um, and here was some planning for it, but I didn't really. I tried tried to paint this, but <laughs> it looked terrible, so I did something else instead. Um, I'm not sure if I made a video of that. If I did, I will add it there. More Guy and Mikael being uh, roommates. I really like the Mikael uh, expressions here. Uh, just more Kai and Mikael color this with markers. I really like this page actually. I don't use green that often so yeah this one's nice. <laughs> I really like Mikael, uh, Mikael's face here as well. Um, I have this, can I say head cannon when they are my, my characters, I guess. Uh, but, well, Mikael is a demon hunter, so um, he has a lot of battle scars. And I thought um, he probably doesn't want to show much uh, skin because of the scars. He's kind of embarrassed of them. Um, but uh, Guy is... <laughs> Guy doesn't mind. So, yeah, that's that. Uh, here's more Rosia uh, being tired. I think I doodled this when I was tired. That uh, explains it. Yeah, and also Josia without his uh, stubble. So, these were uh, doodles for the giveaway winners, the Transvisions uh, anniversary giveaway winners. I. Uh, doodled something for for the, the backside of the print for my for the winners, and here are um, doodles for for like a guide, <laughs> so that I don't fuck up the marker drawing for for the print. Um, so yeah, there's uh, cute yo. This is like my favorite. This is really cute. And also Angie and Dylan, and then Angie's cats, Plague and Otto. Here, uh, <laughs> here are Joa and Dylan. And Dylan is wearing Joa's leather jacket, so yeah, it's really cute. Of Dylan again wearing uh, the leather jacket and nothing else. And uh, Joa, um, I don't know. Here we have some uh, Sofia doodles, Sofia uh, from the witch door. Mm, more Josia, just, I don't know. Uh, this is a side character from tra Transfusions, um, uh, Mark and Joa's uh, landlady. Um, I think I named her Agnes. I really like this doodle, she looks so... <laughs> So adorable here. Too bad I couldn't do show more of her in the comic, but I don't draw old people too often. So, but this turned out pretty, pretty neat. Don't know what's going on here. I really struggled with this one. So, um, this is Yosia. Um, um, a sketch for for another chapter break. Uh, chapter break illustration and some Posca swatches. More Josia with with like a fluffy hair. This is a bit messy page. The red 
lead also kind of smudges a little bit so yeah that's me here's more tristan dark colored with markers and more tristan um here i was kind of like trying to map um all the wounds because he is a shadow runner um and he was previously a member of, of um yakuza <laughs> so he has some battle scars as well he is a fighter uh more tristan just chilling these were some like anatomy studies i guess and folds cloth folds uh sleepy yeah uh, yeah some uh, Mark doodles, Mark with his hair um, not up, <laughs> I don't know. And uh, Nilsa, and also I wanted to draw uh, Nilsa's big brother, Marte. I'm not sure if I'm gonna show him in the actual comic. Um, his, um, Nilsa and Marte are like really old character designs, so I just wanted to try to draw him again um see if i remember how to <laughs> uh more you and mark and colored with watercolors here's another character for the witch star i actually just designed him <laughs> to give a reason for yosia's uh, fancy clothes in chapter five um so this is Fujiwara Ryota, um, he's a Japanese fashion designer, um, witch, and he's a friend of Yosia's and um, they have a deal that Yosia <laughs> will sometimes model for, for like photo, fashion photos for, for Ryota and then he will give Yosia some help with, with clothes. Uh, <laughs> and I wanted to wanted to make um, like a plus size male character, so this was really fun. His design is based on this one old animated movie. Um, I can't remember what the name is, but I will add add a photo and something in the video as well. Um, so yeah, that's why this character exists, just to explain Yosia's fashion choices. <laughs> and then I also drew this, this scene um, that I have had in my mind. Um, Rota comes, comes to visit Yosia and Yosia asks to get some fashion help from Rota for the upcoming um, show that Cassius invited him to with uh, Katarina in chapter 5 of The Witch Star. Uh, so yeah. Uh, Yosia asks for his help and Rota checks his, his wardrobe, is really disappointed in it and blows it up. Um, I really like <laughs> this Yosia here. And yeah, the, um, uh, Rota pick some clothes or they decide so find some clothes that uh, Yosia doesn't wear anymore and then Ryota does his his magic and makes new new jacket out of their old clothes and Loki mocks <laughs> Yosia but yeah that's that's pretty much it and I also have this page here, which is just some random yoga doodles. I really like this this one here, though. Then we have some doodles, <laughs> doodles here. <laughs> I try to censor this a li little bit, but <laughs> I just <laughs> I just love Dula's face here. It's he's it's. It's so funny, yeah. Moving on. Okay, so here we have <laughs> Kai and Mikael again, the roommates. Uh, so Mikael is a demon hunter and Kai is a demon. So, and Mikael, <laughs> I had this idea that Mikael uh, reveals Kai that 
he would also he would like to be a small sport, <laughs> I guess. But since they are um, relatively the same size, um, Kai is pretty skinny compared to Mikael. So to fulfill that uh, wish, I guess uh, Kai does some demon magic shit and makes his body just bigger than Mikael's. So they can <laughs> spawn together and yeah. Uh, then just talk about it. And then Kai just really <laughs> has fun with with this new, I don't know, dynamic and Mikael is kind of weirded out about the sudden difference in size. Yeah, that was just some fun. These were some like merch designs, maybe, um, I don't know. This was probably like a print or postcard and sticker. This is really adorable though, so I, I will try to make, actually make this a sticker at some point. Here I was trying to draw new um, profile images for the cast of the witch door, but then, <laughs> then I decided it was just easier to take a screenshot of actual comic and put those on the cast page. Yeah. Here I, here I tried to draw myself and didn't. I don't like this. Here is some hottest fun art or Hades and more Hades fun art. And more doodles of me that I don't like. <laughs> I, I just can't draw myself anymore. This was like for for a watch, what's in my bag challenge. I just never finished it. More tired, tired uh, Yosia. That's, that's uh, his main theme, I guess. <laughs> I really like this doodle though. This is a short um, doodle comic that I did of um, Josia and Cassius meeting at a cafe. And Josia is wearing a leather, leather jacket that Ruota uh, suggested for him. And Cassius is losing his shit. I really like this, uh, this Josia here though. <laughs> <laughs> and this panel. <laughs> you can read or uh, find this comic uh, on my Tumblr. But here's Josia taking off the leather jacket. Here are some more uh, sticker ideas for for Josia. <laughs> I don't know. He's he's so plain. It's hard to come up with like good sticker ideas for for him. And some more uh, sticker ideas for Sofia. And more sticker ideas. These are really, really old characters. These are one of the, my first OCs from my first webcomic idea that didn't really go anywhere. The story was pretty <sighs> embarrassing since I. <laughs> created it when I was a teenager but I still miss miss these characters and I want to create a new story around them but yeah um, I redesigned uh, this character who is Derek I redesigned him for the the Inktober challenge uh, I did last year so this is just um, me try, trying to draw him again and also redesign the other characters <laughs> since I designed them when I was a teenager and they really needed an update so this is Nate and I think I will give him like a K-pop hair <laughs> uh, yeah and here is this this is a friend group of um, Josh Derek Nate and Jay they had this like goth rock band together and here is Jay 
here are some red ink doodles of you and Mark. I rarely doodle uh, with like this sort of uh, pen anymore. I do use this for whenever I take part in the Inktober or Ink Month. I really like drawing with them, but I'm just so lazy that I never, never use them besides October. <laughs> so yeah, this we're done with with this kind of pen and red ink. I should really try to like do more ink drawings. Their ink is fun to work with. And also stressful but anyway let's move on <laughs> I also drew Josia as a, as a teacher for for the ink month and here is more more teacher Josia and also Cassius this is a comic that I do of Josia and Cassius doing like body swap for some reason <laughs> never really put this anywhere because I I'm kind of a bit embarrassed of it, but I don't know, maybe I should put this on Tumblr. <sighs> you can pause to read it if you want. Here's uh, Josia trying to drink uh, Cassius's coffee, but it doesn't really work. Ooh. And here is character design for Lin, um, the witch in um, chapter 7 of the witch door. This is the first. <laughs> first tries. Here is more of Lynn um, design ideas or just, just trying to find find um, good outfits for her. I really like, here are some spoilers, so I really like this face here. Yeah, I try to <laughs> replicate this face for the comic but it's really difficult. Mm. These are almost the final final design for Lynn but instead I decided to switch these colors so her dress is white and bra is red and I also added her a red scarf. And this is place we see at the beginning of chapter 7. This is the shop of um, Zeb and Ono. This area we see in the comic this is the workshop where they make poisons and potions and this is the upstairs where they both live here i have i had um designed uh, zeb's character earlier this is me like trying to remember how to draw it <laughs> And this is the mystery character we see at the beginning of chapter 7. Mm -hmm. Here is more Lin. I really like this, this face puzzle here. Super cute. Uh, and here is the blueprint kind of or the layout of Lin's house. So they come in from the bedroom door here. <laughs> but this is the, the witch door. And this was the thumbnail for the We'll Be Back Soon illustration of the witch door before chapter 7. And here are um, outfit designs for, for Katarina, Nilsa and Josia for the chapter 7. And then the last page <laughs> we have some doodles of Joa. And that's that. Thanks for watching this tour. Thanks for coming along. Uh, let me know what was your favorite page. <laughs> and yeah, give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I will see you in my next video. Bye bye.